What's up everybody? I'm film director Jackie Terry and in today's video we're going to talk about YouTube marketing and self-promotion. Self-promotion is the ultimate key to success and when I, with self-promotion also comes video editing. So if you want to learn how to self-promote yourself, my advice is to learn how to video edit first. Because you got to realize, video editing controls the whole world of media production. If you can learn how to video edit, you can learn how to control your own promotion. So you can put content out at will without waiting on anybody. So most phone apps, most computers, they have some sort of a video editing software. And when you get the hang of it, video editing isn't really hard. But believe me, it's to the ultimate key to control your content and your media production. Once again, once you learn how to video edit it, that's when the social media platforms come into play. So you wanna upload all those videos that you have to your social media, whether it be Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, you wanna use all three to your advantage. Snapchat, I could be missing, there's so many more, Twitter, you want to use all these social media platforms to your advantage. You got to understand each social media website that you go to, it's free. It's free marketing. You don't have to pay for it. You don't have to do nothing but post content. And most of the time, your friends are going to see the content and they're going to, it's like a domino effect. You do some work, they're going to tell a friend, they're going to tell a friend, and it's like a domino effect. And pretty soon, you'll have clientele of this world. But the main objective is, is to post content, whether it be pictures, videos. In the long run, people just want to see you. They want to see you. They want to be entertained by you. So the more content you can just put out freely, freely, of you doing your work, you, do, you specify any type of talent, you on a video reel, you on a videography reel, you on a modeling shoot, it doesn't matter. It all counts. Content is the ultimate key. And once again, once you learn how to video edit, you can put text in your content, you can add music scores, you can do whatever you want. The thing is, you want to make what you're putting out appealing to the audience. Your audience has to be able to be intrigued into your video in, in the first 10 seconds to come on. That's all you guys, I would, I would want to say 10 seconds. And 10 seconds is more than enough because in that 10 seconds, you can add so much in a video. A video itself is supposed to grasp your attention automatically. So the first 10 seconds, you're basically selling your product to the audience. So if they're not engaged in the first 10 seconds, I'm not even going to say 10 seconds. The first 20 seconds of the video, they're supposed to be emotionally engaged. So what I'm saying is when you put videos out, get right to the point. Don't drag it. And then uh, essentially once you do learn how to video edit, you will learn the ropes and how to make videos a lot more intriguing. You will learn it. Uh, I can teach anybody that wants to learn how to video edit. It's really uh, not that hard, but at the same time, if you need the teacher, I'm right here. I can show you. I can do virtual tutorials if you contact me and we could sit down and do virtual tutorials together because it's all about learning and the more you can learn about different things uh, your craft to better yourself to better market yourself that's the key point because in the long run it's all about expanding and that's what the next topic I want to talk about is expanding so once you get your content out, once you get everything out, you put it on Facebook, you want to expand. So what a lot of things I do is I put my movies on YouTube and I go to these chat lines, which these chat lines have thousands, millions of people on it. And I share my content on those chat lines. And sometimes 
I get positive reactions and sometimes I get negative reactions. But the key point is they're clicking on that video and they're looking at it. And if they like that video, they're going to tell their friends. So it's a domino effect. So the view counts automatically go up. This It goes up. And then one thing about that too, once the view count goes up, they essentially do comment. So it's very important to answer those comments, to engage with your audience. And I'm not talking about engagement like thank you, thank you, or you know, just some simple two word engagements. No, really engage with the audience, ask them what they like about the video, how they, what they thought about it, uh, get their opinions because in the long run, strangers are going to be honest with you. They don't know you, so they're going to be honest with you. Rather than a friend, they, they might tell you what you want to hear. Uh, they might tell you your shit is really good, but it might actually not be that good. So it's very important to get strangers' engagement. So that's why I join these chat lines, and then I interact with the people. I share the link, and I tell them to subscribe to the YouTube, and most of them do. And half of them don't. But however, that 10% have to do, they could have friends or they could tell their friends. And that's how I lot got a lot of my videos to essentially go viral. I share it to these chat lines, people I don't know, but essentially they click on these videos, they see my YouTube channel, they see all the content, and basically they see, oh wait a minute, this guy's legit. Because not only do I have movies, I have workout videos, I have all types of shit on my YouTube channel. So when they click on it, and also on the chat line, I also have pictures of myself in general. And, you know, pictures of the content, the movies and whatnot too. So they know that the person on the chat line isn't fake. And then after that, essentially I do engage with the people on the chat line as well. So it's all about expanding beyond your city. The more you can expand beyond your city, the more you will be successful. And now we live in a virtual world where we can do that. We can sit at the computer and essentially share our work to everybody. It doesn't just have to be people in Kansas City. No, it could be all over the world. Join one of them chat lines, even get on Facebook, add people you don't know, get their opinions. You can even network with people over the world because once they see you doing a certain type of crap they see me doing movies all the time they're like hey how can I be an actor or they see me doing modeling they sometimes they ask me how can I be a model what I gotta do and I tell them so it's all about expanding and then expanding your knowledge and your craft to people all over the world and now with virtual technology to be in the way it is we can do that very easily with one click of a button so once again these are just some tip quick tricks that I use to essentially make my movies, videos, etc. Uh, get, get a good number of view counts and essentially get subscribers and to make it go viral. Once again, don't be afraid to just share your content to a perfect stranger. And my, and I mean, even uh, it doesn't have to be just virtual. Even in the outside world, you can do it. We engage with people all the time. So the more you can sell yourself and sell your content, you can strictly start off a conversation with anybody. Essentially, you can start off a conversation with anybody and tell them what you do and then get them to subscribe or check out your music. One thing is, too, it's good to have business cards. So get some business cards. See it, Jackie Terry? Yes. So get some business cards, too. Do whatever you got to do to get yourself out there and to let the world know who you are. Because there's 24 hours in a day, and sadly, that's not enough. We need more time. So in those 24 hours in a day, you have to make every second count. You can't be sitting still. You can't be sitting stuck. No, you got to make every second count. And then you got to believe in yourself. And then, you, more importantly, you got to believe in the other people around you, too. Because the more, how can other people believe in you if you don't believe in yourself? They They won't. So, essentially, believe in yourself but also help motivate other people around you. It's a domino effect. Everything is a domino effect. The more content you put out, that's a domino effect. The more people you engage with, that's a domino effect. They're going to tell people. So if you got music, if you got a stream, a list of movies, whatever, I don't care what you got, if you got a large quantity of stuff, Go ahead and share that out to the world. I'm talking about the world. Join these chat lines. Talk to people you don't know. Network. 
And I believe, believe me, you'll be highly successful. It's all about opening your mouth. A closed mouth won't get fed out here. It's a cold world out here. And people are going to say no. They're going to say hell no. Fuck you. They're going to say all of that. But who cares? As long as you're talking, somebody's going to say yes. It's eventually. And then, hell, who knows what can happen. The sky is the limit. It's all about putting yourself out there and just having fun with it. Having fun. Love what you do. Love what you do. The money was essentially come, but love to do it first. And then just love to help other people out within the process. Help your clients out. Everything is a win-win. If you're not winning, then your client isn't going to win. You have to believe in yourself, but you have to also believe in the people you work with and strive for not only you to be better, but for them to be better. Sometimes even better than you. Because in the long run, we all have different connections. So if your client is shining, you're shining. It shouldn't be vice versa. You shouldn't be the only one shining. Everybody eats. So essentially, have a marketing plan for yourself, but also have a marketing plan for your clients so you guys can both win because your clients have a different fan base too. So if you guys can work together, that is perfect on a marketing tip. Develop a strategy, develop a game plan, develop how you're going to share these videos all over the world. Communication is the ultimate key. So once again, I am Jackie Terry. And these are just some quick tips coming from me. There'll be more videos just like this coming soon. Don't forget to subscribe and support everybody. Support yourself. Support everybody around you. Share your videos all over the world. And most and more importantly of all, keep God first.